IHS, advancing decisions that advance the world. The port most likely to be at risk is the port of Incheon in the event of any conflict on the Korean Peninsula. This is due to its proximity to the Korean, uh, South Korean capital, Seoul itself. Um, the port itself is around 50 kilometers from the demilitarized zone, which places it out of range of most North Korean artillery pieces. However, we cannot rule out the fact that the North Koreans might fire some of their ballistic missiles, which does have ranges uh, towards the capital, and some of these might uh, land on Incheon itself. The kind of damage we'd like to see are mainly come from the threat of ballistic missile fire. Now, it's very important to stress that Incheon is unlikely to be the main focal point and main target for the North Korean forces. However, due to the inaccuracies of these missiles, uh, then we cannot rule out some of them falling on the port itself. Uh, and any impact by such missile on, for example, the LNG terminal would cause considerable damage. And also the North Koreans could deploy their submarine forces and also the threaten the deployment of sea mines in the very congested uh, approaches to the port itself and these could potentially uh, be an added threat to shipping there. In the likelihood of any uh, actual missile strikes against the port itself, any damage caused would likely place the port out of action for at least several months. The uh, likely cause of action would be to divert shipping to other parts of South Korea. Uh, luckily, the port of Busan has overcapacity, so container ships could be diverted there, and similarly, LNG could be diverted to uh, southern terminals. Any placement of mines or the threat of placement of mines would likely see the shipping lanes going to Incheon be taken out of action for at least a few weeks as the South Koreans and American forces uh, clean the area and declare it safe for transport again. Now, some of the sectors likely affected would be the electronics and the auto industry. This is mainly due to the fact that Incheon caters uh, as the uh, start of the electronics supply chain in the region, and the electronic parts manufactured in South Korea in and around Seoul is sh usually shipped from Incheon to China to be assembled. IHS, advancing decisions that advance the world.